Welcome back, everybody, for our second-to-last scenario from the Mountain Royals. Oh, man, this DLC has flown by. We've got Tamar the Builder. And we do have an achievement in this one. It is uh, Auntie Dearest. Or Auntie Dearest. Ensure Alexios completes his wonder in Tamar the Builder. Let's do it. Although peace reigned for a time, Tamar's recent victories had drawn the Rome Sultanate's ire. With war imminent, my mother thought back to David the Builder's defining moment. Did he build something? The Battle of Didgori was a watershed victory for Georgia, one which permanently established it as a force to be reckoned with. Outnumbered and outmaneuvered by the long invincible Seljuk forces, Tamar's great grandfather led his hardy Monaspas in a decisive shock charge. One which even the victors of Manzigurt could not withstand. Despite this, the Seljuks were only beaten, not vanquished. Now the haughty Sultan of Ram was eager to finally undo Ditgori. He gleefully sent an emissary to Tamar, proposing that this feeble-minded woman marry him, or else be reduced to one of his concubines. When the ambassador delivered the letter to Tamar's court, and in rage, Zakaria smacked the emissary in the face. Oh, that looks like him a punch. That's more than a smack. Undeterred by the Sultan's insults, the Queen wished to resolve the matter peacefully. But more pressing matters pulled her in another direction. Over the prior century, Armenia had fallen on hard times. Its key cities were now held by the Shadadis, whose yoke the Zakarian brothers were eager to overthrow. Liberating Armenia would gain Tamar and her husband a valuable ally in the inevitable conflict against the Seljuks. With the fate of Georgia once again at stake, the queen would finally follow in her great-grandfather's footsteps. We shall see. Maybe. All right, the Zakarian brothers must not be defeated. Uh, defeat the Rome Sultanate. Tamara is restricted to a population of 150. Uh, I guess we can advance to Imperial Age. Destroying uh, Shadadid town centers will cause nearby military structures to switch ownership to the Zakarian brothers, allowing them to train larger and stronger armies. They will not be able to advance to the Imperial Age until the Shad Shadadids are completed, uh, defeated completely. Protect your allies. You'll need their help to defeat the Rome Sultanate. Uh, your enemies will loot gold and grow stronger as they raise buildings. Build extra defenses before investing too much into your economy. If your enemies overrun you or your ally early on, it will be difficult to keep up with them. Tamar starts with a small base in the east. Uh, the Zakarian brothers beat the small base just to the west of Tamar. The Kurdish Shadadids uh, hold the various cities of western Armenia. Their armies consist of swordsmen, crossbowmen, camel riders, and scorpions. Uh, the Armenian subjects supply the Shadadids' forces, but will switch allegiance as liberated. Tamar's ultimate target is the Rum Sultanate, which controls the large fortified city of Erzurum in the far west. The Sultan of Rum fields deadly horde of light-capped camel riders, cav archers, and knights, but will eventually deploy trebuchets as well. Recognizing a common threat in Tamar's growing kingdom, the Saracens promise to reinforce the Rum, uh, reinforce Rum from the south with Mamluk swordsmen, archers, camels, and siege engines. Uh, following the loss of Constantinople to a band of rogue crusaders, Tamar's uh, Byzantine nephew, Alexios, has requested her help in building, establishing a new empire based in the port town of Trebizond. If Tamar can capture the city for Alexios and protect him from the Seljuks, he will become a potent and loyal ally. Many years ago, my great grandfather David the Builder crushed the Ram Sultanate of the Battle of Ditgor. Get you to use my destiny to uphold this system. Sure, why not? Our enemies are well equipped. Tell us what to train, and we shall adjust our strategy accordingly. Uh, to make swordsmen and cavalry, or archers and pikemen. Oh, well, there you go. Get to us. Get to us. Vicum. Martalka. Get to us. Well, we'll just get our, uh... 
The Sarchuk's pillage called with each raising. We must protect our buildings. Alrighty. There. Oh, the Zakari's ex-wife! Oh no. Their marriage fell apart. Tragic. From the uh, the first scenario. The Selchuk's outnumber our forces six to one. We will need to expand our sphere of influence before we can take the fight to them. Alrighty. Farms going. Do a little bit of scouting. Ah, I see that you have finally arrived, Queen Kama. Just the opportunity that I need to make your acquaintance. No. Oh. What a suave guy. Forgive me, Tamar. I did not word that last message to you very thoughtfully. Allow me to rephrase it. Take my hand in marriage, and you shall be the proud mother of future soon. Well, when you put it like that. Makes all the difference. Get you ours. I have received urgent word from my nephew Alexios. Apparently, some reckless crusaders have chased him from Constantinople. He wishes to meet us near the walls of Trebizond to the west. Um. Oh, they actually get gold from raisins. That's interesting. And uh, we'll send a scout over to Alexios. Who I guess will be wielding a wonder at some point. I mean, we seem relatively safe in the short run. My treasury could use some battling. And I know exactly where to look. Uh, maybe I need to make like some monospas or something. Never have I been more glad to see my aunt. Help me take Trebizond, and you will have my eternal gratitude. Alrighty. Okay, there's Trebizond. Get you ours. Okay. Zars. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Yes. Again, this is most likely going to be Monospa Simulator 3000, but you gotta do what the Civ gives ya. Get you ours. Husbandry. 
Oh, I didn't even know I had a dock. <laughs> Whoops. Huh? What perfect timing. Say hello to my Saracen friends. Say hello to my Saracen friends. Well, let's get some defensive structures going here. Oh, our unit production. Get the other four. Things are still more or less fine. Should be more or less fine with Vils. Wait, what? Oh, hi! The Saracens are in green. From Saladin. There we go. Finally, start dealing some Dimaggio. Everyone back to work. Probably have too many bills on food. Uh, I do need to find some gold. Okay, uh, let's start with some writing. Mule cart. I literally just left them. Oh my goodness. Uh, hopefully that'll be enough to last them in the short run. Okay, there's one more raising. Uh, send my Monospas back over. Come on. Come on. Nine gold, please. I'm not going to stop clicking until I get that nine gold. There we go. Again, I think I'm, I might garrison some... Uh, some archers. Okay, back to this. Yeah, I just click up to imp as normal. Unfortunately, I can't go for hand cannons in this campaign, since, you know, that that would be anachronistic. We'd never have that in AoE 2. Trebly. 
All right. Charge! Okay. Now we are all set up as far as those guys go. Do not think for a moment that you will ride over us like your great grandfather David once did. Oh yeah, that's a Persian TC right there. Forgot about you. We have liberated a city from the Shadowness. Now my brother and I can build larger armies. Cool, cool. Should go and pull on the castle over there. Yeah, thankfully there's walking right past me. The Shadowness have occupied Armenia for far too long. Tell us where to go, my queen, and we will take vengeance on our enemies. Oh, whoops. Okay, Saracen's now clicked up. These towers are certainly doing a lot of work. Okay. Uh, I do want it. Hmm. Guess my eco like over. I, I want to make sure as much as my eco, as much of my eco as possible is under the protection of the uh, fortified churches. Okay, what I do want to do though is I want to add in some extra stables. Okay, come on. You can mix in some light cav or something if they start uh, sending in a bunch of trebuchets. That's going to be pretty important, I think. Anyway. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Come on, use those good old Georgian towers. We have liberated a city from the Shadowlands. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Okay, let's loop back up this way. Treboli. Okay, yeah, they're getting a lot of upgrades. Mm. Ah, here we are. Yeah, not that much gold glitch work, which I'm fine with. Okay. Let's get lots of important upgrades here. Uh, what else? Get all the stuff. Frickin' war galleys. I don't need yo nonsense. Go take him down, Spearman. Yes, I know the attack of Monospas versus Archers and Buildings is currently bugged as I'm recording this. I'm not going to play this campaign and not use the Monospas. If you're struggling later, I'm sure the, the same exact things I'm doing will still be effective. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. 
Uh, am I allied with Gray? No, I'm not allied with Gray. Yeah, so I'm not yet sure like how much siege I want to start building up, for instance. I assume the you know the Saracens are to the south and the. Oh my goodness. Yeah, these, these guys are just in Castle Age. They're not going to do a whole lot. Lack of gold, though, could be slightly alarming. A city from the Shudderitz. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Whoa! Um. Okay, let's get that. I guess I need to start littering those, uh... Towers everywhere. Oh man. It's like, you know, liberating those villages is great. Because it helps out your ally. It is inevitable, Tamar. I suggest that you find something fancy. For your grand entrance into my camp. So many sacks of gold at my disposal. But what to spend them on? Okay, we got those. We have liberated a city from the Shudderitz. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. The Shudderitz have been relinquished and captured. Henceforth, the Zakarian brothers shall rule all of her means. Or something. Now I am playing with power. Okay, yeah, we still need to. I mean, they are raising more buildings, which I'm not exactly thrilled about. Anyway, these guys are only in Castle Age, so I imagine our gigantic army of Monospas, other than some conversions, is going to be doing just fine. Don't think they'll have arrow slits now. Yeah, well, oh. That's uh, that's basically where I'm at right now. Okay, it'd be nice not to have to destroy that gate. The Nospas are deleting everything. Wield the power of balance in your own two hands, etc., etc. Mm, there's a lot of dudes. Like a lot of dudes. Okay. I made it. Ah. Oh. 
<laughs> okay, um... Use hotkeys appropriately. But I shall build a palace here to suit an emperor. Help me defend my laborers while they work tirelessly to complete it. Okay, um... We'll do that for sure. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Yeah, I mean, those towers are doing a lot of work. Oh, there are more resources over here. That's nice, I guess. I guess that's all water. Get to ours. Oh, they're actually building the castle with a fair amount of stuff. Or right, wonder. I know what buildings are, I promise. Okay, so long as we're protecting our uh, our brethren, Zakaria, Zakarian. Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Oh, yeah. We are just fine with our towers. Got all that stuff. No, no, no. Up, 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 up. Okay, just walk right through the enemy base. Sure, I'm I'm done bothering about all this. Yeah, whatever. Who cares? Okay, we do need to mix in halves here. about this still. This is another really good scenario, by the way. Feels like this is also a good opportunity to go for some trade cogs. 
can block that there. Okay, well, wonder is going to be done in a moment, and we'll get the achievement. There we go. Auntie Dearest. Allow me to fight alongside you against the Celtics. Let's still go for some keeps here. Oh yeah, go Alexios. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. I'm working on it. Tired of your horsing around. Send something more exciting. Get it horsing around because we're using cavalry. <laughs> or maybe they're just fans of Bojack Horsemen, as as we all should be. Uh, I don't really have anything anti seed for M here on standby. Hopefully, <laughs> this these these towers are so awesome. Okay, that is a lot of siege rams, though. Okay, worst case scenario, we can go to trade cogs. And now I think it's just the big old push. Okay, having three castles in the vicinity should be more than enough for Monospa production. Yeah, they've got actual full upgrades on everything, which feels right. I mean, if we can get up to full post M, they should be able to get up to full post M. Oh, tomorrow, come on. Get in the fight. Now we're getting to unload the power of the Georgian late game. Honestly, there are a lot of really good potential achievements in this scenario. Like, keep the enemy raisings under a certain number. Uh, the one that exists, you know, completing or allowing your ally to complete the wonder, and uh, maybe like defeat the Saracens, like all all that stuff makes for good achievements. Guilds. Oh, 
Don't know what that Manasma was doing, being a lazy butt. I mean, they have a lot of defenses over here. And they're at least keeping the proper purple color from all the time Sturks are in the campaigns. Yeah, the trade routes here wouldn't be very good. Oh, come on. Get in the game! have the Byzantines helping us out from that angle. The Zakarian brothers, I'm sure, are still flinging stuff our way as well. I, at least I assume so. Don't really see them. And dang, these guys have a big base. Oh, come on. Let's, let's go, towers. Oh wow, yeah, navy too. Oh wow, thanks for the Monet. Tomorrow, stop being lazy. Really cool, cool designed base. Oh my goodness, these towers are getting so much value. Uh, 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 I mean, they have a lot of towers too. I mean, we're, we're making it happen. that loot oh I can't access it oh we already have control of the monument please just go away I promise never to bother you again yeah you better a glorious victory for Georgia David the Builder would be proud. There we go. We are victorious. Feels good, man. We got our achievement. Tomorrow's victory over the Selchuks earned Georgia immense prestige. Like David the Builder before her, she wasted no time in making the most of it. Tamar promoted educational reform and built new churches and hospitals throughout her ever-expanding domains. She worked tirelessly to improve the lives of the common people, whom the Asnauris had long ignored. From the humble soldier to the eloquent poet, Tamar cherished every loyal follower who had contributed to her success. She transformed Georgia from a small backwater kingdom into a flourishing empire whose influence stretched from the shores of the Caspian Sea to the highlands of Anatolia. Truly, it was an inspiring time to grow up. In my youth, I never could have foreseen that this realm would one day be laid waste. Yet, as my mother knew all too well, Look at that mustache. even the happiest of moments can swiftly be soured. One night, an advisor arrived with a message that would forever haunt her. Your husband is dead. Oh, sad.
Eh, pretty solid KD once again. Zakarian Brothers not doing them. Uh, Alexios even did more than the Zakarian Brothers. Come on, guys. Get, get your butts moving. Wrecking the Saracens. The Shadadids didn't put up too much of a fight. Uh, I wonder where... I guess those are come from the Raisings. 17,500. So they actually get a good amount of resources from the Raisings. So, yeah, I mean, I think this is a really cool, well-designed well scenario. Shadadids with their negative one relics. That don't make no sense. Alrighty. Oh, there's a relic over there. There's a relic over there. Probably could have scouted those better, but, you know, such is life. Here's the, uh, the base of the Saracens. So, I, I don't know if it's really ever going to be worth it to try and go after them, but, I mean, they get to full post him Saracen stuff. Mamelukes, camels... Arbs, champs, siege. I mean, like, that's... And galleons, too. I wonder if they were supposed to be attacking more with them, because I never saw the galleons in action. Be interested to know if that is the case. Ah, look at that perfectly positioned dock for you to trade with. I see... I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. All right, good stuff. All right, guys, that was Tamar the Builder... And the very last scenario in all of this uh, Mountain Royals DLC will be the Queen in the Panther's Skin. See you guys next time for that one.